Hey, what's up, guys? John from JohnMcNeil.com, and I'm super excited to make this video for you today because I'm actually going to be showing you how to make money as a broke teenager in 2018. And if you're not a teenager and you're looking at this video, no frets, no worries, because it doesn't even matter if you're 65 and retired and you're broke. I'm still going to show you how to make some money online starting with no investment whatsoever. So let's go ahead and jump into this video without further ado. This is how to make money if you're broke. All right, let's get right into it, guys. So what we're going to be doing today is I'm actually going to be showing you how to uh, do what I call digital arbitrage. And essentially what you're going to be doing is uh, you're going to be selling services, freelance services from this SEO site. It's called SEO Clerks. So you're going to be finding jobs on this site where people do different freelance jobs for cheap. And then what you're going to be doing is you're going to be creating a profile on Fiverr.com uh, for the same services, but you're going to be selling them for more money than what you're buying them here. So let me go on and give you an example. As you can see, it says services starting at just $1. A lot of people don't know about this actual website. It's called SEO Clerks, and they do a lot of freelance work in terms of SEO and backlinks and social media stuff, um, graphics designs. I mean, you name it. There's actually, you can kind of go here and click on categories, and you can go through all the different things from articles, WordPress, this, that, the third, they have it all. Or you could just kind of just go down here and just kind of browse the stuff. But so what we're going to be doing is basically you're going to go to SEO clerks and you're going to find gigs, right? So uh, for instance, let's look at this gig here. It says rank on Google first page, uh, and they have a link pyramid. So you would actually just go here. It costs 19 bucks, it says. Um, so you would go here and just basically see what this gig about uh, is what it's about and see what it offers. Um, so it says here, you know, it's going to give you 200 web 2.0 properties plus article directory submissions, 100 EDU backlinks, et cetera, et cetera. Tier two, 500 wiki article backlinks, contextual backlinks, social media backlinks, you know, 800 to 1,000 blog comments, all of this good SEO stuff. And I mean, basically, it kind of gives you a depiction here of what it'll do. So it's basically saying, this is your website. We're going to do all of this stuff here. And then we're also going to link all that stuff to all of this stuff. I'm not an SEO guy, but it looks juicy and it looks like it can give you some good rankings. So um, yeah, so look, this is a link pyramid. It costs $19. So now what you would do is you would basically go over to Fiverr.com and you would want to basically find a comparable gig and kind of find out, get an idea of what these uh, guys over here at Fiverr are charging to see if you can put together a package that would make sense for you to sell that $19 package here and sell it for more money. So let's go over to Fiverr. And I'm just going to go to backlinks. I have not looked at any of this stuff, guys. Um, so I just typed in backlinks and you can already see there's different packages. Uh, I will rocket your SEO rankings uh, for $65. There's like a $95 package. There's a $105 package. So let's just look at one. Um, let's see what this says. Google Authority, 250 plus backlinks, uh, strategy two, 5,000 backlinks, you know, blah, blah, blah. So what I would do is basically I would go through, I would look through a couple of these and what I would try to do is try to find like comparable gigs. So like I would look at what these guys are offering here and kind of compare it to what the, the average of what people are charging on of the fiber site. And then I would come up with some packages on my own. So as you can see, like some of these packages are, are super duper expensive, right? So like, I mean, they call it Fiverr, but sometimes it's, you know, it's, it's pricey. So, I mean, this guy's packages start out at $25 and his $175 and $475, $475. So you could come up with, you know, some packages that maybe are uh, cheaper than this, 
but can still all be fulfilled within this one gig. And let me tell you how you crush the game too. So Fiverr kind of, uh, you know, the way you get popular on Fiverr is delivering and over delivering on every single customer. So for instance, if this gig is saying, okay, I'm going to give you 200 web 2.0 plus article directory submissions, 100 edu backlinks blah 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 so you could come up with a gig that says you're going to get a hundred backlinks to this uh this says 500 so you can say 250 you can say 150 here for these type backlinks and blog comments and then you over deliver right so you're telling them on your fiber gig when you set it up you're going to say, hey, here's you, here's this package. You get 100 of this. You get 250 of that and 150 of that. But you know that you're going to over deliver because this package comes with the 200 backlinks and the 500 social media links and the, the 300 blog comments or whatever the case may be. I'm not even reading this stuff, but you guys get what I'm saying? So you're going to say, hey, I'm going to give you 200 backlinks, but you know if you go over to SEO, you're going to get 300 backlinks, then you're going to over deliver by 100 backlinks, which is going to give you crazy reviews over here in Fiverr, and everybody's going to be nuts giving you five stars. Oh, I only bought 200 backlinks, but this guy gave me 300 backlinks. I highly recommend his services, and then people are going to keep continue to purchase, to purchase, to purchase. So if you're charging, let's say, I'm just making up numbers, if you're charging, say, um, um, uh, $25, uh, let's say $40 for 200 backlinks. So you're going to do $400. That's your first package is uh, 40 bucks, 200 backlinks. And you're, you're buying them over here for 19. So you're basically making a $20 profit, right? Does that make sense, guys? Uh, the idea is you're going to buy something here for cheaper and then create packages here in Fiverr and sell it for more money. And over deliver to these Fiverr folks so that you get, you know, very good ratings. And then people start to just organically purchase from you. And you don't do any of the work because these folks over here are doing the work. You're just like the middleman. You're selling SEO services, right? You're just the business and you're and you're uh, just basically trading the services and you're taking the split and you're making the cut because you're going to still have to buy this. You're going to have to buy this package. Um, to fulfill whatever you're going to offer over here, all right? So let's just look at one more. Oops, quickly. Okay, um, this is one. This wasn't the one I was talking about, but look, but look at this. It says gain three thousand plus high retention YouTube views for three bucks. So high retention YouTube views is basically like somebody watching your video for. Um, a given amount of time. It's not like somebody just clicking on and then clicking right off. Um, so again, you could go over to, to Fiverr and see and type in YouTube views and see, because look, this is $3 for 3000 views. Everything in Fiverr starts at five bucks. So automatically, if we didn't look at anything else, we know we're going to make two, two bucks on every single gig that we sell. But imagine if you sold this 3,000 high retention views for $25, you know, um, you know, I saw one in here earlier. It was like, um, it was like 5,000 views plus comments plus likes. It was crazy. Um, and it was like, I want to say it was like five bucks or something like that. Let me see if I can find it real quick. It was nuts, guys. Let me go through. All right, let's see. They have a lot of these things, you know, like people just buy this stuff. Um, so they have like gig services for comments, likes, and everything like that. But I saw one, it was like 5,000 views, uh, 50 subscribers, and like 10 comments. And it was like cheap. So you can just go through here, you know, again, you can just go to category. And like just again, you go through here, you find gigs that are good, you know, priced and then you go to uh, Fiverr and you find comparable gigs and then you kind of create packages. And the cool thing about this is you're not limited to just creating one profile in Fiverr. You can create multiple profiles. So you can do something in SEO. You can do something in writing. You can do something in video. You can do something in music because you're not, you know, 
physically doing it yourself, you're paying somebody else to doing it and you're charging higher fees for it. So it's called like, you know, I call it digital arbitrage. You're still uh, delivering services to people. And uh, largely that's what a lot of SEO companies do too. They, they charge people and then they farm it out to, uh, you know, they outsource it. So this happens all the time. So um, you can take advantage of it as well. Um, so I think that was all I really wanted to show you guys. So just to kind of recap what we're talking about. So the first thing you want to do is just kind of give you guys a couple steps is number one, you want to find a gig in SEO clerk and then find a comparable gig on Fiverr, set up profile and packages, and then remember to over uh, deliver to your customers, right? And then you can easily, I mean, there's people, I know people that are doing this. I haven't done this myself personally, just because I don't literally want to man the computer and just kind of be going back and forth with folks. But um, if you don't want to spend any money and you have some time to kind of like just manage the process and all you're doing is taking the order, buying it and then making sure that everything is delivered and communicating with the people that are communicating back with you. So if you do have the time to, uh, you know, do this, it's a great way to make, you know, a hundred dollars a day to a few hundreds of dollars a day. There's people on, there are people doing this full time and making really good money just by arbitraging services, guys. This is John from JohnMcNeil.com. Make sure you uh, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't been here. Also, click the link below if you want to get more information about making money with affiliate marketing. Happy holidays, guys. It's Christmas time. Hope all is well. Subscribe to the channel, John from JohnMcNeil.com. Peace.